Okay, I've got my lyrics here. And I just go to my paint box and have paste them in there. Change the color of them to white. Go down three times totally. Really two times pressing it and then save it. Now we go into photo impression. Click edit. Click the effects. And highlight it and set the midtones down and the shadow down and save it. Now to change the color of the bottom text. Let's say somebody singing in the background or something. And you want it to include them too. But then I want it to follow them. You would select it, delete it, and then fill that section with whatever color you want to change it to. Set your behind color to white and click the transparent thing and then drag it right in it. And save it. Okay then, the next step is to make the white area transparent so we can make the red one through it using GameMaker. To make the white transparent, you open it in Microsoft Paint, drag the corner down a bit, zoom in on the bottom right corner, click Edit, Select All, drag it down one pixel, and drag it to the right one pixel. Now it will be a little white line all the way around the scroll. Click File, click Save. Now, go into GameMaker. Under the Text section, click Load Spot. You select the image that you just made transparent. Click Open. Make sure the transparent box is checked. Click OK. Okay, here's my setup. I got one object as the text. It doesn't have no commands or anything because it just sits still. The other object I got is the red color box. It's the same size as the text box. I've set the events for if you press the right key. It will start moving to your right at 0 0.7 speed. I set the red box as def1, so it will be underneath the text object. In the room, I got the settings to where it's just as wide as the box, so it won't be no space left out from my know it, honey. And I placed this red box to the left. So that when I push the right key, it will just run right through it and fill it with cuddle. Now we click one. And now is when you get out your Cam Studio. I've already got the region set to wide 421 pixels and height to 37 pixels. You set it here just under that red thing and like that only showing the black. Then you click once to start recording. Now you click Game Echo. Put your mouse out of the screen. Press the right button and wait for it to fill up the text with red slowly now that it's filled go down here click stop and 
then name the file of the picture. I've done 44 of these, just like this. Here's how to edit the video that we recorded from Game Maker to match the voice of the singer of the artist. You do get in a time, man. Push play until you start to see the red ribbon. And we run it slightly. Cut it. Delete the first part. Right click the second part. Click. Right click the second part. Left click. Video effects. Choose the speed up double. Do it about two times. Okay. That's way fast. So delete one of them. Okay. On that last part, it's a little bit too quick. So we go to that part, split it, back click it, video effects, undo the speed. Still a little bit too fast. So we can split it here, back click here, slow it down halfway. That looks good. Yeah, split it again before it starts to talk again. Then go to the next one. And keep doing it like that until you... I would suggest saving your vid about every five completed sentences because if you keep saving it on the project file, it will probably crash at the end when you go to publish because the file is too large. Just save a lot of parts and then piece them together later. It should be easier for your movie maker to handle. You will probably either need Windows XP Movie Maker or Windows Vista Movie Maker for best performance. Final thoughts. If you would really like to be fancy, you could save it as an AVI file once completed and put it into wax and use chroma key to make the black background transparent and then put it in front of a video. You could also use the quick 3D effect in wax to control the size of the text. Thanks for watching. This is a very complicated project, but the end result is quite cool. Also remember, only save like 30 second sections with wax if you do decide to overlap a video with your lyrics because wax doesn't handle big files too well. From my experience, be sure to stay organized with all parts. It usually takes me six to eight hours to get it matched up with a song, but a lot longer to save because I usually forget to save it in separate files and it takes forever to save it at the end for me when Movie Maker fails. I'm going to try to upload a Game Maker 7 project file in the video description below. So you can look there or you can just design your own. Just make sure text box and color box is the same size. Also make sure you download Game Maker 7. Now let's enjoy the hard work.
click here to see the entire animated video. Also, if I've helped you any, comment. Thanks for watching.